Good morning, Frank Watkins, 8th of November. Unfortunately, Kylie is tied up uh, with a client and Joe is flat out on the desk. The, um, so, yes, you're going to have to just put up with me, I guess. Uh, Friday's broadcast, I mentioned on the All Lords something very loosely looking like um, a head and shoulder. Now, I also pointed out that this um, the best head and shoulder appears at the bottom of uh, a chart rather than as a continuation pattern. Had we seen a head and shoulder back here at the COVID lows, uh, I think that would be a far stronger signal than the current one that uh, I'm sort of outlining at the moment. Anyway, be that as it may, I'll duck into the watch list and look at our higher, higher, higher low stocks so far. First one, 3MF. Um, that's a long way away now. I'm going to delete that from the list. HCO um, had a little attempt at breaking on Friday and has broken today. Uh, pretty thin volume so far, 43000 done, only $9,000 worth, but uh, despite all that, looking quite good. Uh, A3D fell back a bit uh, today, so that's getting a long way away from any potential uh, break. DLC breaking as we speak. 1.2 billion out there. Uh, it is just breaking out decent volume on this 7.6 million done uh, with only 100 or sorry with 136 thousand dollars going into a 1.8 cent stock. So probably a bit more to look forward to on that one. The next stock, DNA, also this is, this is breaking one probable level or did on Friday and again having another bit of follow through today. Uh, 1.24 billion out there, only $4,000 gone into it today so probably a bit of caution still required. Need to look at market depth basically. BM1. Uh, this is one of these gaming stocks, uh, 1.12 billion out there, 300,000 traded today, only $7,000 worth, but I think probably a close above the two and a half cent level would get EM1 going. FHS, no go. HLA, no go. IGO waiting for that break of $10 and I noticed someone put it up on Facebook. Uh, LIT, I think uh, I think really on LIT need to wait for a break of 15. Um, traded at 14 today so not far away. MAT has backed off a bit today. Rex, we're still waiting. Sikkim Rex. Uh, SIX still waiting, SVL still waiting, WCN for Nelly still waiting, and ZZU still waiting. Okay, today's scan, high, 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 low. Let's hit the go button. 14 to look at, HCO, we've already got that in the list. Uh, BNR. Mind the look of this, only 263 million out there. Uh, I shall add that to the list and CNL, it's a no from me. DNK, uh, I think that break of 50, it's, it's a pretty messy looking old chart, but uh. Yeah, break of 50 is going to be very interesting on that one. I'll redraw the line at 50, and I like to go right back 
um, and just see what has transpired at that 50 cent level in the past. Add that to the list. Next one, ICT. Um, I'm going to leave that off the list. Simply the on balance volume has faded dramatically and I try and make a hard and fast rule if OBV is not rising, I don't go there. IEC, that's a very messy chart, not interested. NMC, in actual fact, uh, Newcrest, I've put this up on Facebook in the past, I think, and I was waiting for this gap to fill. The gap is at around $26. Currently, we're trading $25.75. We do have a pretty good higher, higher, higher low on Newcrest. It just depends on how you want to trade it. But that certainly goes into the watch list. Northern Star, very similar. Uh, this is an old favourite of almost everyone. And again, just that line across the $10 level. It's been to 10.16 today. I'd wait for the end of the day to see where we are, but that gets a tick for the list. Uh, NWC, I'm going to leave that for another day, see where we go. ORE, uh, ORE should be in the list. And PTG, it's not as clean as others. Uh, and in fact, I'd be waiting for a break of that 70 cent level, but I'll put it in the list, we'll keep an eye on it. Uh, race Oncology. Uh, this this low is not far enough back for my mind. I'll leave that one. RFT, breaking today, breaking as we speak. Um, yeah, again, I've seen worse, but on balance volume, not quite doing what I want. I'll add it to the list and keep an eye on it. VTG, too much resistance in front of it, too many different levels. There is a gap up here. There's a gap at dollar twelve, but um, yeah, there's too much, too much resistance right across ninety. Then it's going to be at a dollar and so on and so forth. I'm going to leave RFT. Sorry. VTG off my list. And that's it for the day. Thank you all very much. Don't forget the workshop in Perth on the 17th. Touchwood, I'll see you there. Otherwise, talk to you tomorrow. Cheers.